Uh, aortic stenosis is a, a very common condition, especially in our elderly patients. It's a, a disease of the aortic valve, which many of us get as we get older. And the valve malfunctions as, uh, as it deteriorates and it no longer opens or closes properly. The good news is that we have a surgical solution for this condition and the operation is called an aortic valve replacement. Traditionally, we would uh, perform what we call a full stenotomy in which the breastbone is opened entirely to do the operation. With the new technology called the sutureless valve, uh, we are now able to put in a valve actually without using any sutures whatsoever. And this is revolutionary in the sense that uh, that allows the operation to proceed in a much easier and much quicker fashion and that usually translates to perhaps a lower risk for the patient. The other advantage of sutureless valves is that it allows us to uh, implant these valves uh, through a much smaller opening or approach, what we call minimally invasive surgery. From a cosmetic point of view, it's very much more pleasing to the patient having a smaller scar instead of a, a longer scar. Uh, their functional re recovery is better, so they're back to work. So with the sutureless valve, we can avoid all these potential complications, and that may translate into an operation that is you know, substantially less risk for a patient. I've been aware of this technology for a number of years, uh, and, uh, and initially went to Europe to see these implants by European surgeons really got a sense that this there was a significant advantage to this valve for my patients and uh, through the support of Southlake was able to introduce it to North America uh, and uh, consequently uh, we are now one of the largest implanting centers of the sutureless valve in all of North America. So this valve has uh, recently been approved by Health Canada so that's a major milestone in the sense that uh, they will uh, encourage many other centers uh, to adopt this new technology. Because we've had such good experience uh, with this valve, it's not unusual for other surgeons and physicians to come visit us to see this technology so they can bring it back to their centers and, and also uh, for us to visit other centers uh, to give them a guiding hand in their first implants. I think the driving force behind me seeking surgical innovation is my desire to provide the best care for my patients. We don't want to rest on our laurels and, 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 and you know, we want to start another innovation or other innovations. Innovations such as this uh, will really help Southlake's uh, image uh, in terms of a center uh, for innovation.